Hey, this is Kirk Fitzsimmons. I'm here at ICAST 2025 here in Orlando at booth 4552. Here to talk about our new innovative battery technology, a pure solid state battery. It is a lithium battery without any liquid electrolytes or gels. This produces the most dense product on the market. It has no liquid, so it's much lighter, much more energy dense than all other batteries on the market today. They're all smart batteries with their own BMS, and this solid state technology allows you to use the full range of the battery from 100% down to 5%. It is faster charging, a wider range of temperatures from 150 down to minus four. It can be used for ice fishing and on your boats in all applications, from trolling motors, house batteries, gyros, starting batteries, and all of your electronics. Here I'm holding our 12 volt, 90 amp hour battery. This battery weighs 14 pounds. In comparison, the competitive AGM battery weighs nearly 80 pounds. That 100 amp hour battery only gets to use the 80 to 20 rule. So you only get to use 50 to 60% of that full capacity. In this battery, our battery technology allows you to use 95% of the range of battery, all of the amp hours in the box. Here I'm holding our 36 volt, 120 amp hour battery. This is our premium trolling motor battery. This typically replaces three of our competitive LFP batteries. This battery weighs 44 pounds and can power you all day long. Whether you're on the trolling motor, your, your side scans, or your forward facing sonar, this battery has power to last you for all day and then some. Hey guys, Alex Weatherill. We're here at ICAST 2025. Why are we coming to ICAST 2025? We want to find all the new product. Now this product has been on the market for a little while, but it's new to a lot of people. These solid state marine batteries were brand new to me this year, but I've been running them all season long now. I've got four in my boat. I've got two 12 volt 210s, and I've got two 36 volt 120s. Now, I only need one of each of those. I like redundancy, I like having extras, but I don't need it because they have so much power inside of them. and Here's my biggest thing that I like about them. They're half the weight of lithium batteries. So you have AGM batteries that are kind of heavy, and then you have lithiums, and now you have these solid state batteries. So that 12 volt, 100 amp hour is 14 pounds. And then this, this 210 that I'm running is like not even 30 pounds, right around 30 pounds. So to me, that's like taking an entire person out of the boat. Another really big thing for me is the temperature. So I live up Northeast, it gets cold up there. And what happens when batteries, when they get cold, like your phone, they stop working, they don't work right. These batteries go all the way down to negative four degrees Fahrenheit. So I, I can charge them, I don't have to worry about them. I have that peace of mind. So you have the weight savings, you have the temperature savings, you also have additional power. So that same weight in your boat, that would be a normal lithium battery or an AGM at even double that weight, you can have all of this light, lightweight battery, but still have 200, 300, 600 amp hours. So I never run out of power. Like I said, I have a 12 volt 210 and I literally run everything off of it. I have all my electronics. I have four units. I have Mega 360, I have Mega Live. Uh, and usually I'm at half capacity at the end of a 13, 14 hour day. Uh, and on the trolling motor side, I have a 36 volt, 120 amp hour battery that thing weighs 40 pounds i took 180 pounds out of my boat right you're talking 60 to 70 pounds per agm battery that drops down to one single 36 volt battery that weighs 44 pounds so i've got that lightweight little thing in the back charges off a 36 volt charger and that thing lasts all day long and if i wanted to I can put a second one in there and have double the capacity, but I really don't need it because it goes for as long as I can possibly do on a single day, if not multiple days. And honestly, I absolutely love these batteries, just the peace of mind. They have an app, a Bluetooth app, so I can see what my battery percentage is at throughout the entire day if I want to. On the 12 volt side, my big engine's charging that 12 volt battery at the same time, so that thing's getting extra juice. So there's a lot of times that I am staying at a hotel I'm so used to plugging in at the end of the day, I'm now going two, three plus days without needing to charge at all. And honestly, I couldn't ask for anything better than that. So these solid state marine batteries come in 12, 24, 36, and 48 volt options. You have to check them out. They really are something new. And I think you're gonna see them a lot more throughout this industry and many more in the future. Hey, I'm Kirk Fitzsimmons here at ICAST 2025, sitting here with Robbie Taylor at the Jigging World booth. Robbie's a pro staffer with Solid State Marine. We're here to talk about the features and benefits he sees with our latest, greatest battery technology. Robbie? Yeah. Kurt, good to see you. One thing I would like to talk about is just how we made the transition to Solid State. 
I've been testing Minn Kota's trolling motor, which is out now, you know, and from a trolling motor standpoint, Solid State delivers the most power with the longest lasting battery for the smallest space. But then what I realized is all this power also transitions to all my boat systems. So now it's not just a case where I need a solid state marine battery for my trolling motor. I need it for my house battery. I need it for a start battery. And the technology is so vast. I mean, the things that I've learned about batteries that as a charter captain, I didn't even know you need to know really is a game changer. One is the amount of power in such a small space. You can take what normally I had my battery bag for my trolling motor, let's just talk about that, weighed about 200 pounds more and took up about 10 more square feet. Now it's condensed down to the small package. Now, when people are paying me to be on the water on an eight hour trip and I only get four hours of battery life, that doesn't cut it. Now, this battery, I've ran it for three straight days without charging it, and it still haven't, I haven't literally found the ceiling. I'm too scared. I charge it after three days. I'm too scared to find it. So, I mean, some of the things that you were telling me too is, it's, it's not like the other batteries. I mean, battery technology, you can get batteries that are lithium this, lithium that, but the safety aspect from solid state and all the testing that they went through, I mean, is huge. And it's what you should have, I mean, you know. Don't go mixing around golf cart batteries, stuff like that. This isn't your grandpa's lithium battery. This is the latest and greatest of technology. If you want to talk about something that's going to last you, out, probably outlast most of the equipment that you're going to run with this battery, you'll be redoing your electronics before you're changing your battery. I mean, let's just put it that way. You know, if, you, if you're here at ICAST, or even if you just see this later, you've got to check them out, you know? Literally, if you have questions about it and how to integrate it into your boat, Look me up on my website. You know, it's Newport Sport Fishing Charters. You can email me. I love to talk about this stuff because it's like, it's just changed the game on how it works. I mean, before I had to run all my screens on like minimal brightness because my battery's draining down. Now, boom, I'm on 10 all day long. I like that bright, badass display that I got to run all day. You know, I'm not sacrificing any of that. So definitely check them out. Well, right. hey. Thanks, Robbie. That's what Bye. we do.